Hello guys and welcome back to another video. Mitch here and today we're going to be taking a look at how I cable manage my laptop setup. It's more difficult to cable manage for a laptop because there's less space to do stuff with. You can't hide the cables as well. So here's what I did. Starting over here, this is a USB-C to USB-C female adapter that runs off the side of the desk and down below. So this is the only cable that I technically need to run the whole computer. These cable drops that I use are triple cable holders, so they can hold up to three cables, and they're, they have 3M adhesive on the back, so they stick really well to whatever you stick them to. Over on the other side of the desk, I'm using them to hold two USB-C to micro USB 3.0 cables. Now, when I'm video editing or doing something on my computer that uses more storage, these are plugged into my computer. One runs over to a 5 terabyte Seagate external hard drive, which I use for backing up all of my videos as well as other stuff that I keep on the hard drive. And the other cable runs to a 256 gigabyte ADATA SSD. This is the drive that I did all of my video off of. The project I'm currently working on stays on the SSD, and all the backup projects go onto the 5 terabyte desktop hard drive. Over here, I also have a 12th South high and this is used for charging my phone when I'm sitting at my desk basically. Now it has the lightning cable that's run through here and plugs into this extension cord that I have running along my desk. Now I wish this area over here could be cable managed better because especially with this salt lamp here it's got a long cable and there's nowhere I can really hide that. Now obviously the mouse I'm using is the MX Master which is wireless. Unfortunately, I still have to use the dongle because I'm having issues with the uh, connection while using 2.4 gigahertz Wi-Fi, but it's not that big of a deal. Now down here, I have a USB-C hub. So this has three USB type A ports, one of which always has the dongle plugged into it. And then there's also an SD card slot, which is great when pulling footage off of a camera. Now underneath the desk, you can see where the Hutu hub has power pass through, so I can charge my computer just using this one cable that we saw earlier. That runs down the desk into the outlet that I have in here with using a cable drop to keep it tight along the side of the desk. And then from the hub, I have it plugged into the extender because the cable isn't long enough to reach all the way to the computer, so that's why I had to use the extender as well. There's more cable drops down here to hold the cables against the desk so they're not hanging down. So when looking at the desk from the front, you really can't see many cables. There's just this one cable here and then this one cable here that runs out to my softbox. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you want to see more videos like this, make sure you subscribe and give this video a like if you enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one.